Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi My name is uh, Hamayun Latif Bhatt and I am from Copenhagen, Denmark. I would say that, that even though I love my children and my wife and family, Khilafat is more important. The talk about Khilafat is also one which is extremely emotional because it's about love and the love that you have for your Khalifa, which is quite extraordinary because it has nothing to do with it. It is a, a love that Allah instills in your heart. So it's extreme. It's an extreme blessing to have this relationship with Khilafat. So even my <coughs> Danish colleagues, I'm a school teacher. So whenever I come back from London or from Jalsa, they all, <laughs> they say when you come back, it's like you've fallen in love. And I said, well, yes, <laughs> once again, I have fallen in love all over again. And then, you know, and they actually envy my relationship with my family. But one incident I want to, I would like to relay is um, Azul came to Denmark in 2016. And um, as you know, everybody's very excited that Azul was coming. And uh, we had, uh, they had planted flowers everywhere to show Azul you know, how happy we were to see him. And um, what was amazing is that these flowers were all closed. So on the day Hazu was supposed to come, so none of the flowers had blossomed. And I remember thinking that the flowers are not blossoming. <laughs> and then two hours before Zul came. All, all the flowers blossomed. So, and it, was, it was so incredible and it was so <laughs> amazing to see that even flowers were expecting Khalifa. And by the time Azur arrived, all the flowers had completely opened and were, you know, at their peak of their blossom. And, it, and it, was, it, was such, it was such a beautiful scene, you know. You know it was, it, for, for, for those, that week Azur was there, it was like, it was heaven <laughs> had come to Copenhagen. I was with my son, Isa. I was very emotional. <laughs> My son <coughs> was, <laughs> he was very like, are you okay, Abu? And uh, I wanted to explain, explain to him, you know, that <laughs> everything was okay. Actually, everything was perfect. It was, you know, being in complete peace, you know, with Allah. So, so praying behind Hazur is, you know, something I always look forward to. And <laughs> when I leave, I'll be thinking when's the next time.